architects and engineers continually strive to construct the tallest structures known as skyscrapers, showcasing humanity's capacity to achieve remarkable feats. Skyscrapers are not only impressive feats of engineering and design but also architectural expressions of human creativity and ambition. Their beauty lies in their ability to shape city skylines, offer breathtaking views, and stand as symbols of human achievement and progress. In this video, we will be looking at the 10 tallest buildings in the world in 2023, their unique features, and some significance they offer to the economic and touristic development of the countries in which they are founded. Welcome back to our YouTube channel and thank you for joining us. If you are new to this channel, do well to like and share the video and hit that subscribe button to join our channel. Number 10, China Zoon, China. China Zoon, also known as Siddiq Tower, is a super tall skyscraper located in Beijing, China. It is one of the tallest buildings in the city and in the world. It stands at a height of 528 meters, 1,732 feet, with a total of 108 floors. It is one of the tallest buildings in Beijing and the fourth tallest in China. China's state-owned investment firm, Citic Group, has its headquarters located in this skyscraper. It also has a hotel, retail establishments, opulent apartments, and office space. The Zun, a traditional Chinese ritual vessel, served as the model for China Zun's design. The structure has a unique shape that is reminiscent of the sun, with a tapering form, a cylindrical base, and a sloping roof. China Zun's construction started in 2011 and was finished in 2018. Siddick Construction built the structure, which was created by the architectural company Cohn Peterson Fox Associates. Number 9, Tianjin Finance Center, China. Also known as Tianjin Chao Tai Fuk Binhai Center, it is a skyscraper located in Tianjin, China. The Tianjin CTF Finance Center has 98 stories at a height of 530 meters, 1,739 feet. It is among the tallest structures in the world and China. The structure functions as a mixed-use complex with retail, luxury residences, office space, and a hotel. It is a component of the bigger complex, Tianjin Chao Tai Fuk Binhai Center, which is made up of multiple towers that are connected. The Tianjin CTF Finance Center is designed in a clean, contemporary style. The tower is visually appealing due to its tapering shape and triangular top, as well as its curtain wall facade. The Tianjin CTF Finance Center's construction was finished in 2019 after work started in 2013. Number 8, Zhangzhou CTF Finance Center, China. At a height of 530 meters, 1,739 feet, the Guangzhou CTF Finance Center is a super tall skyscraper with 111 stories. It is part of the Guangzhou Twin Towers Complex, which comprises the Guangzhou CTF Finance Center and the Guangzhou International Finance Center, ZIFC. Zhujiang New Town, Guangzhou Central Business Center, is home to both structures. Including office space, residential space, a hotel, and retail space, the Guangzhou CTF Finance Center is a mixed-use development. The skyscraper, which was created by the architectural company Cone Peterson Fox, KPF, has a glass curtain wall facade and a unique tapered shape. It is regarded as one of China's tallest structures and adds to Guangzhou's striking skyline. It was completed in October 2016. Number 7, One World Trade Center, USA. One World Trade Center, also known as 1WTC or the Freedom Tower, is a skyscraper located in Lower Manhattan, New York City, United States. At a height of 541 meters, 1,776 feet, with 104 floors. It is the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere. The World Trade Center complex was built as a monument and replacement for the original Twin Towers that were destroyed following the September 11, 2001 attacks, and this building serves as its main structure. Office buildings, dining options, a broadcast center, and an observation deck are all located within One World Trade Center. Skidmore, Owings & Merrill, SOM, is an architectural firm that designed One World Trade Center. The glass facade of the design is sleek and contemporary, with a tapering form that culminates in a spire at the top. One World Trade Center construction started in 2006 and was finished in 2014. November 2014 saw the building's official opening to both the public and tenants. Number 6, Latte World Tower, South Korea. Latte World Tower stands at a height of 555 meters, 1,821 feet, with 123 floors. It is currently the tallest building in South Korea located in Seoul. 
The Latte World Tower is a multipurpose, mixed-use structure. Office buildings, opulent homes, a hotel, shops, eateries, and entertainment venues are all part of it. The skyscraper has a sleek, contemporary appearance and was created by the architectural company Cone Peterson Fox Associates, KPF. Its tapering shape is complemented by a glass curtain wall facade that offers expansive city vistas. Located on the higher floors of the structure, the Soul Sky Observation Deck is available at Latte World Tower. Visitors can enjoy breathtaking views of Seoul and the neighboring areas from their point 2011 saw the start of Latte World Tower construction, which was finished in 2016. In April 2017, the structure had its official opening to the public. Number 5, Pingin Finance Center, China. With 115 stories, the Pingin Finance Center is 599 meters, 1965 feet tall. It is among China's tallest structures. One of the biggest insurance businesses in China, Pingin Insurance, has its main office in this building. In addition, it has retail establishments, observation decks, a five-star hotel, and office space. Cone Peterson Fox Associates, KPF, is an architectural firm that created the Pingin Finance Center. Its sleek, contemporary design gives it a unique look. The structure has a tapering shape, a spire at the top, and a facade with a triangle pattern. The Ping and Finance Center's construction was finished in 2017 after work started in 2010. It is situated in the central business sector of the city of Futian. Number 4, Abraj al Bait Clock Tower, Saudi Arabia. The Abraj al Bait Clock Tower stands at a height of 601 meters, 1,972 feet, with 120 floors. It is one of the tallest buildings in the world. Also known as the Mecca Royal Clock Tower, it is a skyscraper complex located in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. The collection of buildings has several uses. The Clock Tower Museum, upscale hotels, residential apartments, a commercial center, and prayer halls are all located there. The enormous clock face atop the tower is the most striking feature. The architectural group Dar Al Handasa Architects created the Abraj Al Bait Clock Tower. Modern and traditional Islamic architectural features are combined in the design. With a diameter of more than 43 meters, 141 feet, the clock face on the tower is among the biggest in the entire globe. It completes Mecca's skyline and acts as a notable landmark. Because it houses pilgrims on the yearly Islamic pilgrimage known as the Hajj, the tower is very important. Number 3, Shanghai Tower, China. The Shanghai Tower is a building with 128 stories and a height of 632 meters 2073 feet, in Shanghai, China's Pudong neighborhood. After the Shanghai World Financial Center, it is the second tallest skyscraper in China and among the highest in the world. With multiple uses, the building is used as a mixed-use complex. It has retail establishments, sky lobbies, observation decks, a five-star hotel, and office space. The architectural company Gensler created the distinctive and recognizable twisting shape of the Shanghai Tower. The skyscraper has a dynamic and eye-catching appearance thanks to an outside transparent curtain wall that spirals around its core. Construction on the Shanghai Tower began in 2008 and was completed in 2015. The tower officially opened to the public in 2016. Number 2. Merdeka Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Merdeka 118 is a skyscraper in Kuala Lumpur and the tallest building in Malaysia and Southeast Asia. At 678.9 meters tall, the Merdeka 118 has a total of 118 floors and serves as commercial and residential spaces. It will house office spaces, a luxury hotel, residential units, retail areas, and observation decks. The Wow or traditional kite is one of the traditional handicrafts from Malaysia that served as the inspiration for the tower's design. Its design is sleek and tapered, and its facade is made of glass and geometric patterns. Beginning in 2016, Merdeka 118's construction was finished in October 2021. It is a well-known landmark on the skyline of Kuala Lumpur. Number 1, Burj Khalifa Dubai, UAE. With 163 stories, the Burj Khalifa is 163 meters, 2,717 feet, tall. As of right now, it's the highest structure on Earth. The structure has several uses, including offices, apartments for people to live in, the Armani Hotel Dubai, a five-star luxury hotel, restaurants, observation decks, and entertainment venues. 
Skidmore, Owings & Merrill, SOM, is an architectural firm that designed the Burj Khalifa. Its telescoping shape, which tapers as it rises, is part of its sleek, contemporary design, which draws inspiration from Islamic architecture. Aluminum plates and glass make up the exterior. The Burj Khalifa's construction was finished in 2010 after starting in 2004. January 2010 marked its official opening to the public. It is an enduring representation of Dubai's modernism and architectural mastery. Millions of tourists visit there every year to take in the breathtaking scenery, indulge in the opulent amenities, and recognize the marvels of engineering and architecture. The skyscraper is a global symbol of Dubai's ambition and a testament to that ambition. As we conclude this journey through the world of skyscrapers, we are left in awe of their beauty and grandeur. These towering structures, reaching for the sky, stand as testaments to human innovation, engineering excellence, and architectural brilliance. Thank you for watching to the end. Please do well to leave a review and comment on what you think about this video. Until next time, stay safe.